Hello, welcome to CADM CNC Gyan Online. This talk is part of a series of lectures on CNC machining from CADM Technologies. You may be a teacher in a technical institution, you may be in industry on the shop floor, you may be an entrepreneur, whatever your role. These lectures are designed to quickly give you basic knowledge of CNC machining, which you can then build upon. This set of eight videos simplify the complex area of CNC technology. These lecture videos extensively use CADM's multimedia CNC education software to bring the shop floor live on your screen. Happy learning. In this lecture, I will be introducing you to CNC machines. We will look at a few types of uh, CNC machines for metal cutting and metal forming. The first thing to understand about a CNC machine is that it is the same as a manual machine in terms of operations, cutting tools and work holding. The big difference is in the way that the CNC machine is controlled. On a manual lathe, your brain is the controller. It sends signals to the hands which rotate the hand wheels, which in turn move the tool along the longitudinal and cross slides. Based on feedback from your eyes, you keep adjusting the position and speed so that you get the required dimensions and surface finish on the part. On a CNC lathe, a computer is the brain, motors do the work of hand wheels, and electronic feedback sensors do the work of eyes. The controller sends signals to motors which move the tool along longitudinal and cross slides. Based on feedback from feedback sensors, the controller keeps adjusting the position and speed so that you get the required dimensions and surface finish on the part. The machining operations, cutting tools and work holding on CNC lathes are almost the same as on manual lathes. This is true of any CNC machine, whether it is turning, milling or flame cutting. You can see that this CNC lathe has all the parts that you find on a manual lathe. If you are an expert on a manual machine, you can become an expert on its CNC equivalent in very little time. So let us first get rid of any fear that CNC is extremely complex and unknown technology. If you have been working with manual machines, you already know most of the technology used on a CNC. CNC machines in metal working are used in two broad areas, metal cutting and metal forming. This is an example of CNC turning. This part has turning and grooving operations and you will notice that a grooving tool is doing both turning and grooving. Grooving tools nowadays can also do turning and CNC lathes are capable of tool parts that enable this to be done. This operation called turn grooving is done sometimes to reduce the tool cost and tool change time. On the vast majority of parts the turning is done with a turning tool and grooving with a grooving tool, just like on a manual lathe. This is an example of CNC milling. 
Cutting along a circular path or odd shaped paths is one of the things that you can do on a CNC that you cannot do on a manual machine. Tool changing is usually automatic. A CNC milling machine does both milling and hole machining operations like drilling, tapping and reaming. Because of this and because of other features, CNC milling machines are called machining centers. This is a CNC laser cutting machine. Instead of a turning tool or milling cutter, the tool here is a laser beam. The controller moves the laser beam along a tool path to cut metal plates. The earlier examples were CNC machines used in metal cutting. This is an example of CNC in metal forming, a CNC press break bending a metal sheet. The part loading and unloading is done by a robot. The robot and machine are connected, continuously talking to each other electronically. The robot knows when a part has been completed and unloads it. The machine knows when a new part has been loaded by the robot and starts the cycle to bend it. These are the key messages from this lecture. These are the topics that we covered in this lecture. I hope you found this talk useful. If you have any questions about CNC machining, please call me on the CNC Gyan helpline.